more extreme weather and frequent torrential rains, frequent lightning strikes. NTT Space Environment and Energy Laboratories is studying technologies for controlling lightning strikes to protect cities from lightning and for harnessing lightning energy. We're studying the world's first technology for using drones to deliberately cause lightning strikes. We are conducting experiments in which we fly drones in an actual thundercloud to generate strikes. We induce lightning as follows. First, we fly a drone, drop a wire from it, and sharply increase the electric field at its tip. This triggers an electrical discharge to the sea surface. This rapidly boosts the electric field strength at the tip of the drone and causes a discharge to the clouds. This is how lightning is induced. The device key to achieving this is the lightning-resistant drone. A metal shield called a Faraday cage protects the drone body from both lightning currents and magnetic fields generated by lightning currents. In addition to providing protection against lightning, the shield must be light enough so that the drone can fly stably in strong winds. After conducting simulations and experiments to satisfy these conflicting requirements, we have developed a shield that has protective performance and is lightweight. It can withstand a current of 120 kilo amperes, five times the average lightning current. The induced lightning is guided to the ground for use. To that end, we are studying technologies for converting lightning into other forms of energy, such as kinetic or magnetic energy for storage. Please look forward to our efforts as we take on this challenge. <laughs>